Welcome back to my channel, guys. It's your girl, Coco Styles. And on this channel, we talk about beauty, fashion, lifestyle, and styling, guys. So today, I have a different lens on. So if it looks a little different, that is why. But today, I wanted to talk about fall hats. Now, I am a fedora girl, and I have a million fedora hats, okay? Um, I actually didn't even bring in my riding hat. I have a riding hat that I got from H&M some time ago. I may go grab it. I don't know. But I have all of my, well not all of them, because I have a couple of more fedoras that um, are from BCBG. And they're regular fedora hats, but the brim is leather. But I'm going to jump into all of my hats that I will be wearing this fall. Most likely with trench coats, um, somewhat leather jackets, uh, pumps, booties, over the knee boots, all that good stuff. So let me jump right into it. And the first time I'm actually not gonna put it on. And the reason why I'm not gonna put it on is because my hair is too thick for it. Um, and these are, these are a little bit tighter in size, as far as inside. Um, this hat is by, I don't even know how to pronounce this name. I had it for a long time. It's 100% wool and it's by a company called Yeestat, Y-E-S-T-A-D-T. -T. Um, can you guys see that? It's a pretty nice light gray. Now I'll say this gray is not my favorite color. However, this is a nice gray. It's not like, I don't wanna say like gel gray color. <laughs> It's really pretty, um, but it's a lot more tight around the head. So I like to wear my hair flat down, um, and it doesn't it doesn't sit like an actual fedora on the head because the way it's like shaped on the inside. But it's a lot more. I don't know. I guess you could say. Hmm, I don't want to say tight, but you definitely can't have like super wild hair with this hair, with this hat. So this is my first hat. And again, the company is Y-E-S-T-A-D-T. -T. All right, so something like this I would wear. I'll try to find some photos and pop them in with people wearing like gray hats. Um, and it has a pretty nice little bow on it. Nothing too crazy, guys. And the brim is hard. It has like, I don't know, it's some sort of wiring in the brim. It's different from the lack of color hats, which are the rest of my hats with the exception of one. So that is hat number one. Again, I'll pop in a picture of how you can style this, um, a gray hat, right? So if you don't like fedora hats, you can definitely go for something. You can go for a beret in gray, um, a scully. Scullies are cute. You can dress those up and down. Um, so here's hat number one. And hat number two, actually, where am I gonna put these? I'm gonna put these over here on this rack. Hat number two and three are from Lack of Color. You guys know how I feel about Lack of Color. I love the, I love how they package their hats. Um, actually, I just have one hat in here. I thought this was the other one. This is my green one. Ugh. This hat, let me tell you. Did I wear this yet? No. No. So this hat, oh, beautiful green, a hunter green. Um, you can definitely wear this with neutrals, of course. Um, you can throw some red on with this. You can probably even throw like a red little feather or something. That's cute. I think I might do that for this fall. Um, and this hat size is a medium. I think this is my only medium lack of color hat. I believe I'll, I'll double check um but this is gorgeous and I actually caught this on sale so I'll find I'll find some I'll pop in some photos of you know different ways um, I see people style green hats um, so it'll just be pictures from like maybe Pinterest or something like that um, but yeah pretty green color for the fall this is one of my fav favorite colors like this and red um, neutral colors I love neutral colors they just look better on me. I do have some colors that are brighter in my wardrobe, but my heart is here with the warm colors. 
So this, again, I got this on sale. This one on sale. Now, you guys know Lack of Color does have sales occasionally. So my recommendation would be to create a shopping list. Use the Karma app that I've spoken about before. Use the Karma app and start creating a list. When the stuff starts to go on sale, um, uh-oh. <laughs> when the stuff starts to go on sale, you'll get notified about the sales that are going on. Um, and I'm gonna actually touch on these two hats. I did a video comparing the colors of these two hats, so I'll link that over here. It's this lack of color hat that they call ivory, um, but it's not really ivory. You can't really see it on camera. It has like a yellowish tint to it, but still a very nice hat, and this I got in a large. And I remember I got a large because I wanted them to sit a certain way on me, um, and the large was better because sometimes I'll wear like a unit that's like kinky and you guys know it's much thicker than something that is a lot straighter. So this, I'm looking in the mirror guys. This is gorgeous. I, I cannot wait until the fall like really, really hits so I can get busy. Cause you guys know wearing these hats in the spring is just a no go cause your head is going to be sweating. So beautiful hat, right? You can't really see the color guys because I don't know this let me see if I can move my light over a little bit let's try this um it's still kind of bright but it has like a I don't know it still has the bow on it um like I said I have my other lens in so it may not get the same effect as my other lens but this is a large so if you want to wear hats like this if you are a girl or a lady a woman who wears units maybe big curls and stuff like that, definitely go for the large. If it's too big, you can always get the hat filler and put put it inside to kind of make it fit a little bit tighter. I'm gonna actually skip over the other two lack of colors for now and go into the Brixton hat. Um, this is an actual ivory color hat, guys. This is pure ivory. What that is is something else. However, I'm still gonna rock it, of course. So the Brixton hat, it's nice to, it's not as big as the lack of color hat, but it's still a gorgeous hat. You guys know my issue with Brixton is their shipping, okay? Their shipping, it's no bueno. So this was another hat that I purchased and the other hat that got ruined, not the straw hats, um, another wool hat, that was the last wool hat I purchased from them and I sent it back because it literally was like smashed and they only shipped it with that little plastic piece over it. And basically what happened was UPS destroyed it. Like totally smashed and to the point where I couldn't get that plastic piece off. But this is an actual, and this is a medium. So these fit a little bit different from the lack of color hats. But if you want to, guys, this unit is so big. If you want to get something bigger just always go for a large and just buy the hat fillers and i'll show you on the inside the little space you guys know how hats are the little space you can just put a hat filler in there um and this one has like the velcro where you can just like kind of like tie it in there or whatever um but this is my other full hat so it's gonna be a lot of nice jackets and hats for me this fall um I miss the hat season and the jacket season, and that's because I am a New Yorker, guys. So, I love hats. Um, and then these last two here are, I hope this, this camera looks good. So these last two are lack of color. Um, I said I love lack of color, right? <laughs> and this is more of a, now here's the thing, the lighter color, some people may not wear it in the fall. I still will because I like light colors, but they may prefer this one. And I got this one in a large as well. Um, you guys not been had these. These are not new hats. None of these are new. Make sure. Yeah, none of these are new. I had them already. Um, and this is, I forget which color this is. Let me see. 
here. It doesn't have the color. I can find the color. I can try to find the color. But I'll pop in a photo of somebody styling some these sort of color hats um, with jackets. I'll do it with jackets, right? And this is a large also. You guys can tell that it, it falls, it fits on me different. Um, and I love it. It's a pretty, pretty amazing color. Um, I'm just sitting here. These pants are like digging into my belly, guys. So, yes. Yes, yes, yes. What do you guys think? I love it. I love this hat. And then I have a black one. Um, that's my cell phone. And then the black one is the same. I got a large, I believe. Yep. I've been sticking with large because I like how they um, fall on my head. Now, the thing with the large hats is, again, if they're too big, just get the hat filler. Lack of color has the same thing that Brixton has. They just don't have that little drawstring piece. Yeah. So you just you just stick it under there. And I think I had, I thought I had a, a hat filler. It's in the other bag. Yeah, it's in the other bag. Um, um, so yeah, here's the black one. You definitely need the black hat for the fall, guys. Okay, listen, don't be shy with your hats. If you are a lady who's afraid to wear something big because you're tall, don't be, guys. Like, listen, we're already tall, and it's just what it is. We can't change that, right? You can't cut your legs off. Um, so just try to be as stylish as you possibly can. I am going to try to purchase a few Biker Boy hats. They've been on my list for, like, a good year and a half guys the problem is I don't want to pay that custom fee <laughs> but if I do I'm gonna get multiple hats um and add it on to my other my other um hat that I have in the room which is a like I said it's a like a riding hat that hat is leather it is super 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 cute okay so for this fall I'm definitely going to be wearing a lot of my fedora hats okay and I'm gonna get me a few more I have a whole bunch of berets but I don't know if I'm going to do the regular ones this fall I may do something similar but just have a little little pizzazz to it right so those are my hats for this fall all of my fedora hats that I'm gonna be wearing this fall with trench coats um you know, button ups because it starts to get chilly. Fall is one of those times where it's cold. It's chilly, but it's not like freezing, depending on where you are. Because sometimes New York can get like extremely cold. So that is one, two, three, four, five, six. That's six hats that I have that I'm definitely going to be rocking this fall because that's what I'm going to do. And other accessories that I'm going to end up getting, I have a few pair, but I'm still looking for a nice pair of red leather gloves um i need two pair guys i need a regular pair and i want a pair that comes up to my elbows if i cannot find them i am going to get them made okay i've been oh thunder i've been wanting those for a long time so definitely going to be looking into that getting that soon and of course i'll show you guys so those are my hats for this fall. Let me know what kind of hats you're going to be wearing this fall. Are you a... I'm going to get some baseball caps too. Just for like weekend stuff. But are you a lady who loves fedora hats? Or are you going to thug it out with some... And I said thug it out with some... Um, what do you call those? Some scullies. Scullies are cute also. Because you can... Like I said, girls wear all types of hats. So just depending on your style, what you're looking for. looking The style you're going for, you can definitely wear scullies, baseball caps um the Sherlin hats just get creative guys and again just embrace your style don't worry about what other people are wearing rock what you want to rock guys because if people are not wearing fedoras guess what Coco Sanaya will be wearing fedora hats <laughs> so if you like videos like this please comment below and if you stay to the end of this video please comment Coco we see you and guys don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Coco Styles NY and Coco Styles NYC which is my tall girl page and my blog for tall girls well fashion 
um, CocoStylesNYC.com and my styling services, Coco Styles, CocoStylesNY.com. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.